Hi friends, which is the best programming language and what language I should learn first probably are the most asked questions that I heard so far. So let's try to answer them right now. Let me wear my code hat to look more legit and I have cap. Frankly, this is a horrible question without good answer because you should define first what would you like to do. For example, Python is quite popular and easy to learn language, but if you like to become iOS developer, what's the point to learn it? So, my experience so far. Let's start with some bad examples from my own experience. I learned some basics of C in university and a bit of PHP, but just enough to get my bachelor's degree. Later I started to think about getting into programming. I kind of relearned C from boring book with examples based mostly on math calculations. I pushed through that book and learned all the syntax which was the wrong approach to learn the language and after that I decided that I should learn C++ next just because all the cool developers in a company where I was working as a field technician used it. So I spent months learning C++ just to find myself in the middle of the book still without clear understanding of what I'm doing. My problem here was that I started to learn programming language without clear idea of what will I do with it. That is bad approach. You should know what will you like to build and search for tools to do that. My mistake was that I learned a language first and then started looking where to use it. Let's tell how to choose what to do a bit later. First, I would like to mention some bad choices. C or C++ is not the best language to start. They are quite hard. Pointers, memory allocation, reference counting, you name it. All of that is solved in higher level languages and you don't need to care about that. Start with something easy. I suggest picking something relatively easy, for example, basics of web development or some simple mobile app development. Those are not so hard and you can see the result of your work almost immediately. You can get primitive application installed on your phone in a few lessons. That helps to keep uh, motivation levels high. So, what would you like to build? Firstly, decide what would you like to do in programming. Web development, iOS apps, Android or mobile apps in general, whatever. Maybe you would like to become an expert in data security or machine learning. Whatever feels good for you. If you are not sure yet, uh, stalk people on social networks, follow professionals in industry and try to understand how they spend their days. There are so many day in a life videos on YouTube that can help as well. You can ask me about iOS and freelancing and find someone else if you like to know about different niches. Try to find a mentor. Everyone is busy nowadays and that's unlikely that you will find a mentor just spamming other programmers in, in Instagram DMs. If you have any programmer friend, that's perfect. Ask him all those questions and for many reasons that will be wise to learn whatever he or she is doing. So basically if that's web developer, maybe that's a good approach to learn web because you have someone around who can help you. First programming language is the hardest one to learn and each next will be easier. So if you will decide to switch niche later, that's not so hard anymore when you already get into programming. For example, principles for cycling throws, data masses are about the same in all languages. They have just a bit different syntax. Mentor can be your buddy which still learning programming but is just a few months ahead of you. That could help as well. Check the market, check the jobs for your language of choice. A mentor can help you to understand what is demanded in your local market and also can help you to get into your first job. So, mentor once more. But you can do that research on your own as well. Just check job offerings and ask local developers. Again, uh, Python or JavaScript is quite safe bet, but for example, Swift for iOS development may be more tricky. 
In some markets, cross-platform development is more popular and you may have difficulties getting a job after studying programming languages which are not popular around you, so keep that in mind. So, <laughs> which language is good to start? I can tell about iOS development. If you are looking to get into iOS development that is Swift without doubt, uh, this is not hard language to learn. There are quite a lot of resources for learning and there is nice community around the language and iOS development in general. If you like to do something different, find one who is working in niche where you like to be and ask which programming languages to pick and how to start. Do not do your choice based on some Stack Overflow or GitHub uh, popularity ratings or salary ratings, otherwise you are risking to waste quite a lot of time and do not get into programming at all. If you are interested to learn iOS development, here are resources which will help you to start. And thank you for watching. See you on the next one.